Lions, another big day offensive. We took a little while to get going, but uh, what were you seeing out there today? Um, you know, coming into the series now, end of season, um, a lot of teams know what we're capable of hitting, so they're trying to work around that. So, you know, we got to be patient and understand what, you know, what might be coming from other pitchers, but, you know, just staying with their same approach and, uh, you know, doing what we do. You hit that home run, and, like, into the teeth of the wind. I mean, did you have some anxiety there thinking it might not make it out? Um, I knew I crushed it. And, you know, the reaction of the fans, I kind of knew that it was going out by the, uh, you know, they started jumping up and down. Um, yeah, I was praying that it had a little, you know, two legs to grow and get out of there, and, you know, it did. And so, um, you know, put a good swing on it, and good things happened. You've been on a couple of good offenses. They, they've had some stretches. This one seems to be good just about every week. And right. if there's not that many holes. It doesn't matter who y'all bring in. Just how good do you feel like this offense is, especially right, right now with the way y'all are hitting? Um, you know, I want to shout out Coach Gotro. You know, he's the best hitting coach out there. Um, you know, he gives us the right approach. He gives us the right mentality to go up there and understand that we're the best. And so when you have a you know a whole club of guys that with the same mentality, it's dangerous. And um, I know people are like, oh, they're hot right now, but. I know we've worked too hard for just to be hot for one little period of time. So, you know, when one guy does well, another another guy might not. But the next day, you know, it could be reversed. So that's how we look at it. You've been really consistent in this season. I think you reached base in 28 straight games at one point. Had some long history in there. What do you attribute your individual consistency to? Um, you know, just going up there at the same approach, knowing, you know, what my ability is and what I'm capable of doing and understanding that, you know, I'm in this league for a reason. I'm an older guy for a reason. I know how people are going to pitch me now. You know. Just going up there with you know confidence. You're leading this team in walks, which is something you don't see a lot out of a cleanup hitter. Right. Uh, what, what's leading to that patience at the plate? Um, understanding what pitches I can hit. What pitches I used to chase were something I couldn't hit, even if I made contact. So you know, seeing pitches well in the zone, knowing where I can hit them, and if they're out of that zone, I'm not swinging, and they're most likely balls. So you know, just understanding what pitches I can and can't hit. So if it's out of the zone, you know. Just taking them. With this tough stretch of series coming up over the next four weeks, how important was it for y'all to build momentum over these last two series? Great. Um, you know, it's been there, but it's baseball. You have your ups and downs, and I think we were a little down not long ago, but we were still doing well, and now you know we're climbing again. You have a, a pre at bat ritual where you go up and you write something in the ground, and some people even notice it on social media. What 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 do you write in the ground, and what's behind that ritual? Um, I write GB. It's for Grandpa Bruce, from my grandfather that just passed last week. Um, yeah, I know he's up there watching over me, and you know, like I said, that home run probably grew a, little, a few feet for him. So, um, you know, I go up there, you know, I write GB in the ground, I hit my chest because I know he's in my heart, and you know, I'm just going to continue to do that. Well, let's talk about getting these games in, moving some game times around, making sure these games are played. How important is that to to get these games in like right. that? People making smart decisions, to get, um, get all this done. It's uh, you know, as a baseball team, we y'all probably hear more than we do, honestly. Uh, we just got to be ready and stay focused, and so that you know the game times can change. We can get them in. We you know we just got to have the mentality that we're going to play no matter what. And so when you go out there with that mentality, you know you can definitely tell when we're ready.